before NSI came on board, we've had these recurrent episodes all over Nigeria of machines breaking down, of patients being on treatment, and then maybe a quarter of the way down their treatment, the machine breaks down, the patient has nowhere else to turn to, the cancer at that point in time starts recurring and recurs with more vigor. It's like me slapping you and you wonder what, what I, you are slapping me. And of course you want to fight back with, you know, it's just the same reaction. So the cancer will now come back with more vigor. And of course we just stand there, trying other means that you know are not so effective, trying to treat the patient until ultimately the patient uh, dies. I remember when I was here previously, there was equipment. It was old equipment, old LINAC equipment, and it was not operational. It was not working due to various reasons, uh, age related and also um, maintenance related. The government under President Abbasanjo, also we know, he tried to resuscitate about nine radiotherapy departments in Nigeria, including this hospital, Luth. But again, everything, because we don't have the culture of proper maintenance, because we want everything cheap, because we want everything free in Nigeria, we lost all of those. The miraculous appearance of NSIA into the affairs of uh, Luth and their fears of trying to help with cancer management in Nigeria is one that is uh, very welcome uh, indeed. And one that has actually made a lot of significant difference to the care of patients in Nigeria at the moment. Uh, we have some of the best equipment that money can buy, some of the best equipment in the world, uh, to do radiotherapy treatment. We have a um, latest machine. I think a machine at the moment, I think I'm very right, it's the second main machine in the West Africa. There's a huge difference coming from a place that was, you know, practically not accessible, place was disorganized, some places were leaking, they were practically using like one room, you know, to see in a centre that is fully operational. Of course, there is a huge difference. I had very good service here, and um, and I'm very hopeful I'll be healed totally from the therapy here. I'm doing radiotherapy, as I'm doing here, and um, I'm very impressed with what I'm getting here. I've been involved also in trying to make sure that the system runs and runs effectively. That the machines that we have, that they are properly serviced, that they are properly, we do the necessary calibrations, the necessary daily checks, that we make sure that everything works and that they work perfectly since installation up till now.